Welcome back to the video blog. Adam Daniel Mize is my name, your PMD, Producer of Marketing and Distribution. That's what PMD stands for, Producer of Marketing and Distribution.com. Thanks again for watching. This is the video blog. Welcome to my backyard here in Toronto, Canada. So, let's see. I'm going to be on the radio this Sunday, the 21st of November. It's at 12 p.m. Pacific time. So for people in New York, Philadelphia, Toronto, or Toronto as it's called locally, spelled T-R-O-N-O, -O, that's for Ian Kath, at Ian Kath, down in Australia, in Brisbane. For those people who are on the Eastern time zone, that's 3 p.m. on Sunday, the 21st. I will be appearing on the show along with John Rees, award-winning director John Rees, director of the award-winning documentary Bomb It and Bomb It 2. Go ahead and check out some of John's great extra diegetic material, bonus material at babblegum.com. Just put in Bomb It and the number 2 and see what comes up to you. He's got about, I think... 14 or 15 excellent clips of different places where he's gone around the world documenting, chronicling street art. John Reese, of course, is the author of thinkoutsidetheboxoffice.com, that famous DIY, do-it-yourself distribution book that is made primarily for independent filmmakers, which again chronicles John's journey uh, in trying to get his documentary with Tracy Wares uh, distributed independently, even after selling out their premiere screening at Tribeca Film Festival in New York to sold-out lines that were snaking all around the corner in the city. So he talks about that in Think Outside the Box Office. You can go to the website, buy the book. It's now out in second edition. So the show, of course, will be on Film Courage, which is David Brannan and Karen Warden's great indie community site. I'll be speaking there as a PMD. John will be speaking as himself, director, and, of course, he'll probably be getting into issues of the PMD, which is a role that he coined. And, of course, he'll be making reference to some of the cutting-edge techniques that PMDs utilize to get traction for their clients, for the films that they represent, that they market and distribute for. I'm hoping, and I mentioned this to the direct, to the excuse me, to the people who are in charge at Film Courage. I mentioned to them that I'd like to get into specific case study material of client work, not of course naming clients, but getting into techniques that I use to get traction for the films, to get to talk about how we go about casting around for business, how we go about canvassing our services, what kind of events that we attend, how do we get traction for ourselves, how do we build up our brands, our personal brands, that is, as PMDs, and educating, moreover, educating the public about what PMDs are. I'm hoping that this hour of conversation between myself and John, that by the end of the show, you, the audience, will understand what PMDs do. There will no longer be any doubt, at least amongst our little community of people who want to know how what PMDs do for a living and how they spend their days. Now you'll know. And I'm grateful again to John and to David and Karen for the opportunity to speak about what I do and what I enjoy doing most. So, that's the date. November the 21st, and you can catch a whole slew of prior shows at Film Courage, and believe me, they're all good. I'm not just shilling for my show. I listen to this show every Sunday. If you can't get it live, it's going to be available, what I call tape delay, or you can download the podcast at filmcourage.com. It'll be up there as a post. Anything and anyone that's on that show generally has really good advice for filmmakers and musicians, independent musicians, that are looking to gain audience traction, promotion for their film, more than just PR hacks, and like I said, more than just the shill. This is the real deal, and these are people that know what they're talking about. So hopefully you'll have a chance, and if you are there, send in a tweet, participate on the filmcourage.com page, there is a space for people to do a live stream, and you can send in your questions by email filmcourage at gmail.com, and then I'll try to respond to anything if you have any questions. Thanks again for watching. It is getting cold here in Toronto. I'm sure you can see the steam coming out of my breath. I know I've said that a million times, but it'll get worse as the days go by, and I make a commitment to you to recording outside until I just can't stand here anymore because my camera will blow over from the wind. You'll be seeing snow behind me over here on the grass. Yes, I'll be out here doing it in the snow. Thanks again for watching. Catch you again tomorrow, and I wish for you success with your indie film and many, many good things. And by the way, if you want your project up here on this particular piece of real estate, you can make mugs, send them to me, and I will hold them up on the show. Get in touch with David and Karen. They know how to get in touch with me. Take care.